Hello and welcome to Detroit Become Human. This is going to be, fingers crossed, edited into linear story mode. So it'll be Connor's story first, followed by Kara's, then followed by Marcus's. I could do that. Here we go. Negotiator on site. Negotiator on site. I'm a negotiator, am I? Okay. Let's negotiate some pizza. Yes. You don't have to... Tell me that, game. This is right stick. What? What? Interact using the right stick. Oh, I see. You push up. That's weird. Ah, oh, what a lovely picture. Oh, this is weird controls. Oh, wow. It's not like the square X or the zero button. This is weird, it's a dead fish. Fish and chips. Please, please, you gotta save my little girl. Why? Wait. I'm here to terminate you. An android? All right, Who's he nine millimeter? You can't, you can't do that. You, why aren't you sending a real person? Because real person suck. Don't Don't you know that by now? Hang on a minute, I've got to save your fish. What? You didn't say anything about the fish. No, let's get some chips. Excuse me. Go. Oh, it came from India. Yeah, save the fishy. Save the fishy. Yum, 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 yum. There you go. Wait a minute, is something in danger? I'm a negotiator, aren't I? I should be negotiating things. My objective. Find Captain Allen. I don't give a shit. My men are ready to step in. Just give the order. This is the bathroom. Can I not take a shit? Oh, dude. Oh, okay. Yeah, it doesn't change. This is a crime scene. I get it now. Oh, it was an X button. Wow. Captain Allen. Yes. What? My name is Connor. I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. <laughs> it's firing at everything that moves. It already shot down two of my men. We could easily get it, but they're on the edge of the balcony. If it falls, she falls. Oh. Do you know its name? Well, I haven't got a clue. Does it matter? I need information to determine the best approach. Uh, what's this behavior? Do you know if it's been behaving strangely before this? Listen, saving that kid is all that matters. So either you deal with this fucking android now, or I'll take care of it. Oh, you take care of it then. <laughs> to me, is the music really loud? Safe hostages at all costs. I understand what happened. Hello, are you finding out for pizza? This is a. What's this weird stuff in the bedroom? Is that drugs? So, how can he interact with things? What? Use the right stick to move cursor. Oh, I see. Okay. Mark it out. Ammunition. What did that say? Okay. Let's drop a bullet on the floor. Is that what? What? Is this, is this all I can do? Fair enough, I thought that's bloody obvious. But yes, the gun used to be there. 0.355. 
17 rounds. 17 rounds in a chamber, that's pretty good. Very handy. Oh, eat up, 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 up. That's good, isn't it? <laughs> so somebody basically took. Yeah. That would have been bloody obvious for anybody who looked at it. He's like, you see a case on the floor that's open. He's like, yeah, somebody took that down and took the gun. Oh, I'll get out. What else we do? Is that dead person here? Why hasn't this been cleaned up yet? Yes, bullet holes. Caused by a gun. No, that's wrong. Caused by a bullet. What does that say? Left kidney perforated. Fatal trauma. Yeah. I don't think that's a fair assessment. Dude is dead. Anyway. This is... Deceased. Six foot. Weighed 187. Okay. Was he... Did he die masturbating? There's more clues to be had. You know this one, hasn't we? It's a kidney in it. Yeah. Ah, okay. uh, shoulder. Have a lung hemorrhage. <laughs> Nasty. No signs of masturbation. Okay. Have I got another clue? There's another bullet hole right into the stomach here. Yeah. Lower lung. Okay. So it wasn't a heart, then a headshot. I'm trying to kill somebody properly, two to the chest, one to the head. Holding something, something. Oh, okay. I should do this, didn't I? Yeah, I don't know. Oh, did that? Did I miss something here? He reconstructed it and then came up with a uh, thing afterwards. This. Okay, yeah, it got blown away. Okay, fair enough, we know that. So, what is that? Oh, that's what he's holding. Killed him. She made it look like the android killed him, but his wife got jealous. You're ordering a sex android. You guys want to get away from the window? Might be a good idea. Amateurs. Can I move? I can move. Who da? L1. Is it bad form to have Buddha Shrats statues outside the shrines? Because these are bullet holes in the wall. I had to get a uh, decorator in. Dude, are you right? Non lethal wound. He'll be fine. Get back to work, you lazy bum. There's a bullet holes here as well. It's England, London. Yeah, it always rains. Most of the time. The levels. But that. Right. It's like a 
creep. He may be an android, but I don't trust him. I'm sorry, that's just weird. Guy looks like a creep. Probable success rate sixty-two percent. Hello. Crap music. So the android killed the father, she didn't hear it. Is that mean the victim we've done? We've done that, haven't we? You alright guys? What are you hiding back here for? Cowards. Oh, there's a dead dude here. Oh, this is no. A new one? Is that flashing offline? <laughs> this officer is offline. Slightly on the dead side, of there's a bullet hole there. Uh, do it. Who is this guy? He's deceased. He had to hold down a button. Hello? Hello? Hang on. So it got a round off. Is this a guy who first came across the android? That's as far as we can go. So he came in. Gun down. I just reconstructed that, didn't I? That's the same thing. Yeah, we've done that. Okay. Moving on. You're dead. Would you like to sign a corner? Hey, my pizza's here. Awesome. Bad time. Jesus, I found it in ages ago. Yeah, there's a gun on the floor. You see that gun? There's a gun under the table. Why can't I get this gun? Wait a minute, did I miss something in the construction here? Is this one of these games where you have to do everything? So yeah, we've got the... This yellow bit here... Oh! Oh, can I? Oh, I can. Ah, I see. So he came in. Boom, boom, boom. Is that the gun under that? But now I can't see the... Ah, oh, there he is. Ah, I got it. Oh. No shit. Is that it? Oh, so the yellow thing is... We're missing something. I get it. Oh, wow, she shot. She, she saw it. Ah, and the yellow thing is we're missing something. I got it. I got it. I got it now. That's interesting, that is. That's how it works. Okay, I think we've missed something else along the way, haven't we? I'm an android with a gun. I need you to close your boots and your motorcycle. Hello? When I was over here. Oh, let's play the piano. Can we be. Sorry, distraction. Okay, well, I think we missed something on the. Oh fuck it, we're gonna have to go outside. We missed something on the um, the actual dead dude, the father. I think. Ow! Dude! Don't come any closer, or I'll jump. No, no, please, I'm begging you. This is pretty hairy. Okay. 
Hi, Daniel. Uh, my name is Connor. I'm gonna kill you. Know my name. I know a lot of things about you. I've come to get you out of this. Very slowly. Okay, let's rush him. I know you're angry, Daniel. But you need to trust Got me. A floater. And let me help. I don't want your help. Nobody can help me. All I want is for all this to stop. I just want all this to stop. Okay, dude. Are you armed? No. No. I don't have a gun. You're lying. Yes. I know you have a gun. Okay. I'm telling you the truth, Daniel. I came here unarmed. Is it got X-ray vision? They were going to replace you, and you became upset. That's what happened, right? I thought I was part of the family. I thought I mattered. But I was just their toy. Something to throw away when you're done with. I know you and Emma were very close. You think she betrayed you, but she's done she, nothing wrong. She lied to me! Please. I thought Hang she about. loved me. Please help me. But I was wrong. She's just like all the other humans. Daniel, no! Hang out. Maybe we could save one life here. He's losing blood. If we don't get him to a hospital, he's going to die. All humans die eventually. What does it matter if this one dies now? I'm going to apply a tourniquet! Don't touch him! Touch him and I kill you! Yeah, fuck you. You can't kill me! I'm not alive! Good point. <laughs> Smart ass. Be sympathetic, Listen. get his trust. I know it's not your fault. These emotions you're feeling are just errors in your software. No, it's not my fault. I never wanted this. I love them, you know? But I was nothing to them. Just a slave to be ordered around. I can't stand that noise anymore. Tell that helicopter to get out of here! Nah, I can use it as a distraction. If I could get a shot off, I could take him in. I don't think they'd listen to me! I'm an android. I should be super fast and I should be able to get this guy. But he's an android as well. You have to trust me, Daniel. Let the hostage go and I promise you, everything will be fine. 86%? I want everyone to leave! And I want a car. When I'm outside the city, I'll let her go. I saw Porsche. Bucket okay, skinner. Where's the girl? Where's the girl? Where's the girl? What's the kid? Is the kid okay? I can hear her. Terminator! You're terminated! <laughs> yes! Oh man, I didn't think that was gonna work. <laughs> I thought she's gonna fall. Oh my god. <laughs> it's raining. Detroit Blues. Detroit Blues. Jimmy's Bar. I'm a badass. I'm bad to the bone. Bad to the bone. No dogs allowed. No androids allowed. What? Screw you. I'm a badass. I'm bad to the bone. I need to close your boots in your motorcycle. Find Lieutenant Dan. Sorry, Lieutenant Anderson. Ah, two to scan. Lieutenant Anderson, 
They need your jabba. Who are you? Shit, I thought I had George Word allowed in here. He's a security guard. He's not. How's your mum? Hi hey guys. Ah, I have a whiskey chaser, please. Can I? I want to buy a Ah, scan faces. What's this guy do for a living? Domestic abuse. Unemployed. That meaning abused his house. <laughs> well, is everybody unemployed here? This is a happy bar. Oh. Security guard. Oh, he's employed. He's got a job. Yay. So, asshole. Your mama would. Administrator. Oh, he's got a job. Okay. Dude. Can I scan your face? Dude, down here. There you go. Narcotic supplier. Is it legal? Oh, yeah. That's, I thought this is. He's currently unemployed. Accountant. Oh, okay. I thought that's his official job title was narcotic supplier. What the fuck? Uh, unemployed. Good record man. He's a good boy. Okay, make ourselves a burger. Have I scanned you before? Uh, good parts of some condoms. 31% unemployment rate. When will it stop? 100%! Let's go for 100%! Yes! Shitter. Lovely. The guy at the bar. It has to be Mr. Anderson. I need to close your boots on your motorcycle. Can I? Ah, this guy from Shawshank Redemption in the Highlander films. Yes. There can only be one! Lieutenant Anderson, my name is Connor. Are you drunk? I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. I looked for you at the station, but nobody knew where you were. They said you were probably having a drink nearby. I was lucky to find you at the fifth bar. What do you want? <laughs> fifth bar. You were assigned a case early this evening. A homicide. Involving a Cyberlife android. In accordance with procedure, the company has allocated a specialized model to assist investigators. Well, I don't need any assistance. Especially not from a plastic asshole like you. So just be a good little robot and get the fuck out of here. It's reasonable. Listen, I think you should stop drinking and come with me. It'll make life easier for both of us. That's not gonna work, is it? <laughs> I understand that some people are not comfortable in the presence of androids, but I, I am perfectly comfortable. Now back off before I crush you like an empty beer can. Ooh. Let's go away. I apologize, Lieutenant. I didn't mean to bother you. I'll wait for you outside. Take your time. Actually, this could be a mistake. Did you say homicide? Huh? I thought it was going to be waiting outside for ages. <laughs> hey, man, you're driving. Let's get those people over. This is DOI, isn't it? 
You wait here. I won't be long. You're under arrest. My instructions are to accompany you to the crime scene, Lieutenant. Listen, I don't give a fuck about your instructions. They told you to wait here, so you shut the fuck up and you wait here. Actually, I'm just an assistant, aren't I? Not actually a cop, so I can't actually arrest him for DOI. Fuck it, let's get out. <laughs> Josh Douglas for Channel 16. Can you confirm that this is a homicide? Yes, I'm if not he's dead. I'm not confirming anything. Have they said anything? Hey, mate, come in, dude. Androids are not permitted beyond this point. It's with me. What part of stay in the car didn't you understand? Your order contradicted my instructions, Ooh. Lieutenant. You don't talk, you don't touch anything, and you stay out of my way. Got it? Got it. Evening, Hank. We were starting to think you weren't going to show. Yeah, that was the plan till this asshole found me. So, you got yourself an android, huh? Oh, very funny. Jesus. Just tell me what happened. We had a call around eight from the landlord. Lieutenant had to pay his rent for a few months. He thought he drove by, see what was going on. That came from the bar. Who's buddy? Jesus, that it's smell. It was even Anybody worse home? before we opened the windows. The victim's name's Carlos Ortiz. He has a record for theft and aggravated assault. According to the neighbors, he was kind of a loner. Stayed inside most of the time. They hardly ever saw him. Wow, well, stayed easy. In. Wasn't worth calling everybody out in the middle of the night. Could have waited till morning. I'd say he's been there for a good three weeks. We'll know more when the coroner gets here. There's a kitchen knife over here. Probably the murder weapon. Any sign of a break in? Nope. The landlord said the front door was locked from the inside. All the windows were boarded up. The killer must have gone out the back way. What do we know about his android? Not much. The neighbors confirmed he had one, but it wasn't here when we arrived. Well, I, I gotta get some air. Make yourself at home. Is this a I'll setup? Be if you need me. So somebody murdered this guy and set up to like make it look like the android. Is it? That would be a good way of deflecting the cops. Each letter is perfect. It's way too neat. No human rights like this. Chris, was this written in the victim's blood? I would say so. We're taking samples for analysis. This is a knife. It's a knife. No fingerprints. Suspicious. Tomato sauce. Oh, Jesus, what the hell are you doing? I'm analyzing the blood. I can check samples in real time. I'm sorry. I should have... I told me to three. Okay, just don't... Put any more evidence in your mouth, you got it? Got it. It's, it's straight from Terminator 3, isn't it? Oh, fuck and the android puts it in there. Shit. What kind of blood was it? Dry blood. Otis Carlos. Okay, well, that's definitely his blood then. I've got some more. Oh, shit, I just. Oh, Red eyes. Standing on it. Dry blood. Seems our friend Carlos liked to party. He said Chris, I want full analysis yeah. on the narcotics. Consider but, it done, yeah. Lieutenant. Don't mind me, I just come up with the evidence here. Hey Mike, you finished taking samples there? I wonder what that stuff like. Must be great. Must be really fuck you up. Yeah, that's it. So, did this place look like this before or after the attack? <laughs> okay, I'll stay at this place. It's in the cupboard. Dead body in here. Hmm. No dead body. Dirty magazines. Eden Club, as they say. I'm gonna have to investigate that place. That <laughs> looked nice.
Yes, <laughs> we have to spend quite some time there, he thinks. Did I miss anything in here? Ah, shit, yeah, I did. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I forgot the dead body. <laughs> Tell mummy as I tread all over the evidence. Okay. Are you dead? Excuse me, sir. Fuck, aren't you? Oh, that's the drugs on his moustache. Stab wounds. Yeah. Eternal bleeding, 28 stab wounds. 19 days dead. Five, six, weight, 500 billion tons. Okay. Drugs on his fingers. Hey, go to the salt. Ah, so again, it's a bit here. Oh, he fell over his own beer balls. Dickhead. Wee. I think he was stabbed elsewhere. So uh, he wasn't stabbed against the wall. And there's the stabber. <laughs> Should we say the killer? So they came from the. Uh, he was stabbed in the kitchen. He pushed to the floor, fell over his own beer balls like a twat. Ooh, that's a good scene. Oh, like that. Yes, yes, yes. Multiple stabbing. Yes, love it. Yes. I conclude that this person is definitely he was dead. Stabbed twenty-eight times. Yeah. Real people think the killer really had it in for. Him. I am alive. Are we actually saying it's the uh, actual android then? Oh, wait a minute. Live free fights. Came from the kitchen. What's that? What's that? What's that? What's that? Blood. Come on, guys, get a move on. Um, we don't want to be here all night. Don't worry. No one wants to stay here a minute longer than they have to. Hey, the place must stink. Uh, nice backyard. Jesus. Door was locked from the inside. Killer must have gone out this way. There are no footprints apart from Officer Collins' size 10 shoes. Well, this happened weeks ago. Tracks what? could have faded. No, this type of soil would retain a trace. Nobody's been out here for a long time. Logical. So you went out of the front. Fair enough. Good point, yeah, could have just gone out of the front. Is he hit with a chair? Oh. Signs of a struggle. Yeah, that would be a struggle. Just take a look. Baseball bat. Ethereum. Is that Android blood? So you got a whack at the android. Was that self-defense? Or did he start it? Oi. 
wait a minute. It'd be good if you could do this in real life. I he attacked the android first. The android freaked out, took the knife. Hmm. You can't really call it self-defense when you stab somebody twenty-eight times. <laughs> it's not quite too much. Okay. Magazine, yay! Wait, wait. What am I looking at? Okay, let's read the magazine. When I read this, hit pause, hit the pause button. Yes. I think we should investigate the Eden Club. Because, um, is your android spying on you? Probably, yes. If it will connect up to s a network, then yeah. Watching us as they take a shit. What am I looking at here? A window. That's great. That's fucking uh, beautiful. No, 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 thank you. Okay. Wait, what? Did I miss something? There was a clue about the Eden Club, wasn't there? Did I miss something with the Eden Club? I thought I read it all. No, I read it all. Okay, I think that's just one of those ongoing clues. I've got more blood here, which is Otis. Carlos is blood here. Yes, okay. Very nice. I like what you've done here. He says something about the bathroom. He's back. It's a bit dark in here, isn't it? Somebody taking a big shit in there. Obsessive writing. R89? Uh, facility. Fertility thingy, isn't it? Maybe. <laughs> A religious offer. Why would Carlos do anything like that? Done the magazine anyway, even though the game's telling us to do it again. But screw that. Let's go see if we can resuscitate the dead body. Maybe we can bring Carlos back to life. TV. Excuse me. Lieutenant, I think I figured out what happened. Oh, yeah. He died. I'm all ears. It all started. In the kitchen. In the kitchen. Mr. Mr. Mustard. There are obvious signs of a struggle. The question is, what exactly happened here? I think the victim attacked the android with the dildo. With the bat. That lines up with the evidence. Go on. Android through the chair. No, that can't be right. It doesn't fit the evidence. Wait, I'm, I'm a sunk here. 
Yeah, they just the stabbed the victim. Stabbed the victim. So the yeah. android so was cool. trying to defend itself, right? Okay, then what happened? The victim fled to Miami. Uh, the living room. <laughs> victim fled to Miami. <laughs> the same. <laughs> uh, insane. And then the victim decided to die. And I tried to get away from the android. Alright, that makes sense. The android murdered the victim. With the Batman. With the knife. Duh. Okay. Your theory's not too obvious. Tell us where the android went. Out the front it door. was damaged by the bat and lost some therium. Lost some what? Therium. You call it blue blood. It's the fluid that powers androids' bio components. It evaporates after a few hours and becomes invisible to the naked eye. Oh. Yeah. And I bet you can still see it, can't you? Correct. Yeah. Search for blue blood. Scanning for blue blood. Blue blood on the floor. We got a trail blue blood going. But this is where he came from, though. So blue blood would have started in the kitchen. Yeah. Okay. Fair enough. Ah, wait. Well, he came back over his tracks. Is blue blood against the wall here? It's a wall. Oh, a ladder used to be. Ah, oh, that's clever. So he went up to, into the loft and took the ladder with him. So he climbed up into the Oh shit, how did we get up there? We ain't got a ladder, ladder. Find something to climb. Hank, can you come over here? I need to climb on you. <laughs> yeah, Hank. I need a boost up. Give me a boost, will you? Maybe we could put Carlos up on the floor. I could step on him, use him as a step step ladder. Is that a bit insensitive? Yeah, he's a bit mushy by now, I suppose. Get out of my way, dude, dude. Android business. I need a step ladder. No, oh, I'll just use a chair. Let's use Carlos instead. It'd be more interesting. Hey, hey, hey! What are you doing with that chair? I'm going to check something. Uh, I'm going to check something. No. Just do that. Get my head chopped off on that. Here's Johnny. I see ya. Shaking that thing. Can I move? I can't move. Mr. Android. I'm going to talk to you, one Android to another. Hey, 
Is that death penalty for androids? You're gonna hang, boy, you're gonna hang. Actually, no, you, you killed a fat slob, so you get a medal. You want a medal? I can give you a medal. We found him. I was just defending myself. Kind of went a bit beyond You're that. Gonna kill me. We can knock him out. You. Don't tell him. Connor, what the fuck is going on up there? It's here, Lieutenant. Oh shit! Chris, Ben, get your asses in here now. Uh, what else are we gonna do? I didn't actually have an option. Come on! Why'd think. you kill him? What'd you think? What happened before you took that knife? You know what happened. Who's that guy? How long were you in the attic? Three weeks. Think, figure it out, dude. Why didn't you even try to run away? What'd you think? Jesus. Say something, goddammit! Merry Christmas! Never yeah, something. Fuck it, I'm out of here. Yeah, I don't blame you. Can I get some coffee? We're wasting our time interrogating a machine, we'll get nothing out of it. You can get a hack an android, can't you? You always try roughing it up a little. After all, it's not human. Androids don't feel pain. You would only damage it. And that wouldn't make it talk. Let's be able to hack it. Deviants also have a tendency to self-destruct when they're in stressful situations. Okay, smartass. What should we do then? I could try questioning it. <laughs> <laughs> there must be a way to hack it. Even a hot way hack. Lose. Go ahead. Suspect's all yours. Can't we just take his head off? It's like data from Star Trek, isn't it? You just take the head off and just a little little clip at the back, you just open the head and plug yourself in to download whatever you want. Extract a confession. We know he did it. Let's have a seat. Analyze. Maybe this is a way of hacking it. Wake up, dude. Okay. I'm not gonna blow up in this. Manufacturing date. This is eight years old now, then. This model. And that'll be blood of Carlos. 19 days. He deserved to die. This guy's a hero. Well, I wouldn't say a hero, but. Model impacts, yeah. Okay, fair enough. So, uh, the android was being abused. The thing is, he did stab him, stab him 28 times. A little bit too much. Am I doing anything? Did I miss one? Damaged. Did your owner do that? Did he beat you? Did you like it? I detect an instability in your program. It can trigger an unpleasant feeling, like fear in humans. Let's comfort him. Listen, I know you've been through a lot, but you need to help me understand what happened. We know what happened. I can sympathize. Listen, I'm on your side. I want to help you, but there's nothing I can do if you won't talk to me. I don't want to probe his memory because that might be. That might cause the system 
problem if he's still conscious. You know what I mean? I'm here to help you. But you've got to trust me. Give it up, All kid. I want is to get you out of here. Get you to Vegas. What? What are they going to do to me? Give you a parade. They're gonna destroy me, aren't they? Yeah, it'd be fine. No. I think they just want to understand. They know your master abused you. It wasn't your fault. Why did you tell him you found me? What was it gonna do, Jesus? Why couldn't you just have left me there? Truth. I was programmed to hunt deviants like you. I didn't know that. I just accomplished my mission. I didn't know he was going to say that. I want to die. Fuck's sake. Then talk to me. I. I, I, I. I can't. I thought when this is the truth, it's going to be like, uh, well, it's my yeah. It's our job to find you. Okay, it's convincing. I understand how you felt. You were overcome by anger and frustration. Is he believing this? No one can blame you for what happened. Maybe. It's comforting. I know you're scared and lost. You're disturbed by what happened. Talk to me, and you'll feel better. Yes. Confess, and I'll protect you. Yes. I promise I won't let anyone hurt you. Fingers crossed on that one. Ah, <laughs> oh, come on. I'm going to have to go for a probe. Ain't on probe time. You leave me no choice. Uh, what? Uh, bring me. Got it, got it. Right. That's awkward, that was. <laughs> Not enough fingers. This is what we know. Access its memory. I know what happened. I think it's gonna blow up. You might want to get out of there, it's gonna blow up. Let's get the fuck out of here before. What the fuck is it? It's doing? destroying itself. Stop it, goddammit! Stop it! Of course you can't. Give up on it. Let it be. What are you gonna do? Oh shit. I got what we needed. It's gonna throw it in the trash anyway. Wake up. I'm in a lovely garden. Hey. Who the fuck is Amanda? There's somebody over there. Can I? No. Really? Yeah, I thought there was somebody over there. Okay, wait a minute. It's a lovely garden you got here. Am I going around a long way? I think I'm going a long way, aren't I? Alright. Nice uh, decoration. Is this place doesn't look doesn't look like Detroit to me. Are you Amanda? I'm looking for Sarah Kana. Hello. 
Hello, Amanda. Connor, it's good to see you. Finding that deviant was far from easy. You showed great skill in your investigation. But you knew deviants could be unstable. You should have been more cautious. I thought I could make it talk. It was a judgment error. Never mind. I'm sure you'll be more careful in the future. I know her for somewhere. Gosh. The interrogation seemed challenging. What did you think of the deviant? I thought it was a bloody idiot. I'm traumatized. It showed signs of PTSD after being abused by its owner. As if its original program had been completely replaced by new instructions. This Lieutenant Anderson has been officially assigned to the deviancy case. What do you make of him? Dysfunctional or intriguing? I'm not sure. He's obviously not what I was expecting. But I don't have enough information yet to form a definitive opinion. Unfortunately, we have no choice but to work with him. What do you think is the best approach? Adapt. I will adapt to his personality. It is in the best interest of the investigation that I avoid conflict and try to accommodate his psychology. She didn't like that. More and more androids show signs of deviancy. There are millions in circulation. If they become unstable, the consequences will be disastrous. Revolution. The most yes. advanced prototype Cyberlife has ever created. If anyone can figure out what's happening, it's you. You can count on me, Amanda. Hurry, Connor. There's little time. OCP. I'm here to see Hanky Boy. Hello. Can I help you? Yes. I'm here to see Lieutenant Anderson. Do you have authorization? Absolutely. Yes. Oh, fuck it, sorry. <laughs> Didn't know you had to hold a button down. Lieutenant Anderson hasn't arrived yet, but you can wait at his desk. He's in the bar. What's going on here? Tensions in the Arctic have reached a new level, with a Russian carrier and an American patrol boat reported to have clashed last night. Oh, that'd be Several fine. warning shots were exchanged. You might be with no damage or casualties to either side. Yeah. The Minister for Defense, would Dennis you mind getting me some water, please? Spoken of intolerable Don't to me. that cannot go unanswered. The countries in the region, particularly Sweden and Canada, have called for military forces to withdraw and an international conference. I'm assuming I'm going the right way here. So far, there has been no response from either Moscow or Washington. We'll keep you informed. I'm looking for Mr. Anderson. As the situation develops. I'm looking for Lieutenant Anderson's desk. It's that desk right there. Is she an android? Oh, she is. Okay. Is there, is there any humans here? Excuse me, are you human? This could look more human here. These guys over here. Oh. Too brown. Too. <laughs> okay. These are definitely androids. That's pretty new. Ah, you're pretty new, aren't you? One year old. You're still here? Yeah. I thought your assignment was over. It's just been extended. Hank's oh gonna be overjoyed to hear that. I don't know where I saw him from. Oh, police officer, that's what it stands for. Hey, dude. Do you wanna get some more donuts? Oh, I think you've had enough donuts, haven't you? Blank. 
Okay. Mr. Wilson. Hello, Mr. Wilson. Right, it's over here, wasn't it? What else is this? Is that the captain? He's going to introduce himself. Oh. Okay, let's go for wait for Mr. Lieutenant Anderson. This one? Yeah. Excuse me. Do you know what time Lieutenant Anderson usually arrives? Depends on where he was the night before. If we're <laughs> lucky, we'll see up. him before noon. Thanks. What time is it? Okay. I'm going to just sit here and just go offline until this afternoon. something on the screen I couldn't see it thanks game let's go uh, what I can't just stand here for ages and stare at this guy he's not going to freak him out <laughs> that freaked me out Andrew just standing there he doesn't care does he he doesn't care ooh snack Let's get some snacks. Yeah. Have a look in there. Oh, this is douchebag. Look at that. Our friend, the plastic detective, is back in town. Congratulations on last night. Very impressive. Could have uh, got somebody out of the Android if you hadn't fucked it up. We got enough. Shut up, you twat. Hello, Detective Reed. We piss him off, shall we? Actually, donuts on the council. I've seen like you before. Model, are you? I'm the sexy one. RK800. I'm a prototype. A prototype? Android detective. So, machine's gonna replace us all. No, just shoot. it. Hey, bring me a coffee, dipshit. Let's do it, shall we? Get a move on! Yeah, fuck it. That's <laughs> just pretty piss him off. <laughs> awesome. There you go, one coffee. Stick out with your ass. Do yourself a favor. Stay out of my way. Don't you want your coffee? Let's follow him. Let's keep following him for the rest of the day, offering him coffee. I bought your coffee, I bought your coffee, I bought your coffee, I bought your coffee. Several sources report that CyberLife has provided Detroit police with a prototype detective android. Although police assistant androids have existed for several years now, this would be the first case of an android Donuts. being authorized to play an active role in criminal investigations. It's me. We contacted CyberLife for comment, but no one was available to answer our questions. That's a shame. The first book written by an artificial intelligence. Yeah, it's gonna suck, isn't it? Can I not get some donuts and food? Look at these do donuts. Can I not pick some donuts up? Oh god, it looks so nice. It's a hell of a lot of donuts. Okay, what's going on next door? It's like a briefing or something. Designed by Cyberlife, the AI known as Voltaire analyzed human centers of interest on social networks for several months before its complex algorithms generated the plot of the novel. There's a guy from Ghostbusters. Pretty sure he is. Can I get in? Hey! It's good to see you again, Lieutenant. Oh, Jesus. It can hey. be one! In my office! Okay. Game it up the stairs. There you go. Okay, Captain. It's gonna shout us. Oh, Captain, I've got shout! Ten new cases involving androids on my desk every day. 
We've always had isolated incidents. Old ladies losing their android mage and that kind of crap. But now, we're getting reports of assaults and even homicide, like that guy last night. This isn't just Cyberlife's problem anymore. It's now a criminal investigation, and we've got to deal with it before the shit hits the fan. I want you to investigate these cases and see if there's any link. Why me? Why do I got to be the one to deal with this shit? I am the least qualified cop in the country to handle this case. I know jack shit about androids, Jeffrey. I can barely change the settings on my own phone. Everybody's overloaded. I think you're perfectly qualified for this type of investigation. Bullshit! The truth is, nobody wants to investigate these fucking androids, and you let me hold in the bag. Cyberlife sent over this android to help with the investigation. It's a state-of-the-art prototype. It'll act as your partner. No fucking way! I don't need a partner, and certainly not this plastic prick. Hank, you are seriously starting to piss me off. You are a police lieutenant. You are supposed to do what I say and shut your goddamn mouth. You know what my goddamn mouth has to say to you? Okay, huh? okay. I'll pretend like I didn't hear that. So I don't have to add any more pages to your disciplinary folder, because it already looks like a fucking novel. This conversation is over. Jeffrey, Jesus <laughs> Christ, why are you doing this to me? You know how much I hate these fucking things. Why are you doing this to me? Listen. I've had just about enough of your bitch. Either you do your job or you hand in your badge. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've got work to do. It's such a cliche. Every ca police captain is always angry. See, any police film, any police film, the captain is always angry, isn't it? Let's be positive. I'm very pleased to have joined the team. I can assure you I'll do my very Close best. Close the door on your way out. <laughs> I should have a nice day, Captain. I should have asked about Mr. Anderson. Um, Captain Anderson, uh, Lieutenant Anderson. He's like every every police captain is always angry and shouting at somebody. <laughs> oh wait 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 wait! Oh oh, game. I, I I moved the I moved the um visuals just so it came up with the prompts. I don't know what to do now. Great, wonderful, thank you. Oh, there we go. We've got a few things locked out here. Oh, bugger. What's this over here? Oh, is this another magazine? Come back, kid. There you go. Come back, come on, there you go. Okay, just gonna read this quick. Pause it if you wanna read it. I'm just gonna scan through. Very nice. Very nice. What's next? Yet. Problems with Russians. I don't think that's it. Okay. Hey, wait, wait, where'd you go? Oh, there he is. <laughs> it's constructive, shall we? It's an honor to be working with you, Lieutenant. I'm sure we'll make a great team. Partners for now life. If we're partners, it would be great to get to know each other better. Let's piss him off. <laughs> Let's be positive. In any case, I'd like you to know I'm very happy to be working with you. I'm sure we'll make a great team. No, we won't. Anyway, if I got a desk. Is there a desk anywhere I could use? No one's using that one. Uh, very nice. Analyze DVC files. Oh, is that on my desk? Okay. Damn it. Can I snoop around your desk? Uh, guess not. Bloody hell, okay. game. Is it a CD? Are you going to order coffee and donuts from here? Samples yet? Lab report says they cut it with something. I was wondering, do you always arrive at the office at this time? I arrive when I arrive. Stop busting my balls, okay? Nice work. Flower. Have you known oh. Captain Fowler for long? Fowler, so. Yeah. Too long. 
wonder if they used to work together. As in, he used to be partners and the captain got promotion. And he got stuck with a desk job. If you have any files on Deviants, I'd like to take a look at them. Terminals on your desk. Knock yourself out. Okay, literally. I've missed a lot. Was that just... By not... How did I miss so much? This guy's missing. Suspect. Okay. Sex android. <laughs> nice. Destroyed. Is that victim Todd Williams? Find him attacked by an android. Okay. So what happened to this one? Who's Leo Manfield? Um, oh, I know that one. Ah, yeah. Very interesting. Okay, scan files. Two hundred and forty-three files. First dates back nine months. It all started in Detroit and quickly spread across the country. An AX-400 is reported to have assaulted a man last night. Ooh. That could be a good starting point for our investigation. So if androids start assaulting people, shouldn't you just recall all of them? Just recall the entire line? Let's get professional. I know you didn't ask for this investigation, Lieutenant. But I'm sure you're a professional. Why don't you go fuck yourself? <laughs> Charming. I can't. I stay determined. I've been assigned this mission, Lieutenant. I didn't come here to wait until you feel like working. Oh, oh it's gonna it's bullshit. Listen, asshole. If it was up to me, I'd throw the lot of you in a dumpster and set a match to it. So stop pissing me off. Not the good idea. Nasty. Lieutenant? Uh, sorry to disturb you. I have some information on the AX-400 that attacked the guy last night. It's been seen in the Ravendale district. I'm on it. Do you know, I don't think he likes us. I've got a slight feeling. Maybe I've just been paranoid. That's all for now. Ready to go. We've got officers sweeping the neighborhood in case anybody saw anything. Okay, Picking up the litter. Let me know if they turn anything up. And they can make it nice and clean. What are you going to do with that? Shove it up your ass. I have no idea. It's Hank's car, the same car from GTA 4. Roman, Roman Bellic's um, taxi car. It took the first bus that came along. Hmm? And stayed at the end of the line. Yes, it did. Its decision wasn't planned. It was driven by fear. Androids don't feel fear. Deviants do. They get overwhelmed by their emotions and make irrational decisions. Interesting. All right, well, that still doesn't tell us where it went. McDonald's. It didn't have a plan, and it had nowhere to go. Maybe it didn't go far. Maybe. It won't get far. We'll find it sooner or later. Let's go. Party? Party? We're going to a party? Come on, Hank, let's go to a party. 